The Shaping Theory, as introduced in Media, Culture and Society by Paul Hodkinson. This theory is also called the hypodermic needle theory, coined by Harold Laswell in 1927. The shaping theory is that the media presents representations and concepts which either intentionally or unintentionally, explicitly or implicitly, shape our culture and our society. It is a linear relationship that is said to work like a needle to the human body. Content is delivered through a needle straight into society to be absorbed instantaneously. The effect on culture and society is direct from the media producers communicated through their choice technologies, such as television, advertising campaigns, magazines and more. An example is with beauty standards as an accepted social norm in a community. The concept of a beautiful woman is presented to us through pictures posted on social media from friends, celebrities, models or even companies. The constant bombardment with this skinny, flawless, long-haired woman influences society to connect our idea of beauty to what we see before us. This is then confirmed when we turn to other media sources with more obvious and incessant bombardment. We are directly provided with the single representation of a beautiful woman not only on our own social media, but when we are using media as a source of news and current affairs, or something entirely unrelated. When, as an active audience, we seek out sources of media, we find that we are not in control over what we consume entirely, as we are consuming images of professional models in advertisements and on news articles and on almost all other forms of media, unintentionally. Because of the representations of beautiful women in the media, we end up having films where the selective casting leads to hypersexualized presentations of women, being a set standard held by the community of what women in the media should look like. Women are then cast in supporting roles, only to represent the sexualized sidekick or the damsel in distress. Both conventions or tropes created through the media's direct effect on audiences. The media influence also then changes interactions within society. Women seek out and aim to look as flawless as these representations they see everywhere. And a standard is set as potential romantic partners or friends being women that they must look like that. In this way, the media is a shaper or constructor of society through representations. Thank you.